Yes, Mr. Felix. Look, a perfect place to have our lunch. An apple tree. Swell. This is the life, huh, Poinsy? Yeah, Mr. Felix. Great. Hey, what's all that stuff bulging in your pockets? Rocks? These are my toys. Such as what? My midget Geiger counter. Midget Geiger counter? Yes, and my little spectrum analyzer, and my handy dandy isotope integrator, and... Okay, okay. Don't overdo it. Wizard, we got two of them this time. Huh? Where am I? And who are you? They call me the Wizard. I know I was just dreaming all this. This is no dream. I pull you out of the future with my magic apples. Magic apples? I say. Ah, the other specimen. Yeah, but this one looks smart. Hmm, a capacious cranium. Genius type. Young man, I hereby appoint you an assistant to wizard. What is your name? Poindexter. And that's Mr. Felix. Felix, an odd name. Yeah, sounds like the name of a cat. If you jokers are finished, we'll be on our way. Come on, Poindexter. Coming, Mr. Felix. My word, a castle. A medieval castle. Amazing. Huh? Either I'm dreaming, or we're in Hollywood. Who are you? Uh-oh, a stairway. It must lead somewhere. A 
treasure. Looks like a gun. Maybe I can scare those... Felix, what are you doing here? Yeah, you should be out in the moat, waterlogged. Stand back, or I'll shoot. Grab him, Sir Rock. Okay, you ask for it. Huh? Huh? Hey, wizard, you look like a bag of bones. You don't look so good yourself. What have you been eating lately? Wow! Let me out of here! Wow! Me too! Jeez! You did it, Mr. Felix. Nice work. Yeah. What is this thing? It is my pocket x-ray machine, Mr. Felix. I knew it would come in handy. That it did. Felix in 
to atoms in the next chapter of the adventures of Felix the Cat. What a duffelhead that professor is! <laughs> he made a world hero out of me! I made a boo-boo, I made a boo-boo, I made a boo-boo, I made a boo-boo! Wonder where I am now. Wow! Eskimos! Huh, guess I'll drop in on them. Coming down. He's coming down! He's getting away! I'll go to Alaska! And fix him for good. <laughs> no cat can double cross me. Welcome, Felix the Cat, first cat in space, our hero. <laughs> Thank you. 
Did you send for me, Professor? Yes! Get me that bag! shoulders. Size 44. Let her rip! Professor, I thought we was after his coal mine. Just a figure of speech, stupid. You mean we'll clobber him? No rough stuff. All we want is his gold mine. I get it. <laughs> Here comes Felix now. Get behind that sign. Hey! Why the cannon, stranger? I'm the sheriff in these here parts. <laughs> I'm really the professor, but Felix doesn't know it. You're under arrest. What's the charge? Uh, there's no charge. This here's a free country. What's in that bag? Gold. Hand it over. Here. Hmm, chicken feed. <laughs> Deputy? Huh? Oh, that's me. Take this here prisoner to Judge Crater's court. Okay, Sheriff. <laughs> Stagecoach Harry, Sawdust Carmen, One-Eyed Big Terry. Order in court. Prisoner, what are you guilty of? I'm not guilty of anything. Come, come now. Everybody's guilty of something. Listen, every man commits a crime at one time or another whether he is mean to kids or unkind to his mother. Punishment should fit the crime. Swift justice mustn't fail. So I will give you time to think. No! And 30 days in jail. I feel a draft. You, you the professor. Yeah, how about that? Deputy, lock him up before I lose my temper! They can't do this to me! Or, or can they? But the 
Professor heading for my gold mine. Well, Professor, this time we'll get Felix's gold mine. Yes, watch your step, stupid. I'm coming up. <laughs> Gun, Mr. Felix. Well, shut it off. Okay, Mr. Felix. I meant slowly. Sorry, Mr. Felix. What's keeping your uncle? It's getting late. The doorbell. Who is it? Space Graham from Mr. Poindexter. Well, what is it? Oh, dear. It's from the Master Cylinder. He says, I'm holding your uncle, the professor, prisoner on Mars. You can save him by following instructions. Uh, what are the instructions? Pack trunk with laboratory equipment. Stand by window. You'll be picked up in ten minutes. Don't bring... Felix. Well, what do you think, Mr. Felix? Start packing. If you've got to go, you've got to go. Now to get my anti gravity gun. Oh, 
going, Dexter? Where's my uncle? Oh, uh, he's out. He's with Master Cylinder. Now you go to laboratory and invent super rocket fuel. Oh, so that's why you brought us here. All right, General Klang. I shall do my best. Hmm. Felix. <laughs> What with us? I tell you, Earthman, Poindexter invents super rocket fuel, and I, General Klang, invade Earth. Yeah? How are you going to do that? With army, of course. Look! Rocket ships! Millions of them! And now you go see Professor, no? Huh? Hey, what's that thing? A hitching post for nosy earthmen. I snap on handcuffs, so, and leave you forever. Forever? That's a long time. Gee, what a tough break. Poindexter comes to Mars to rescue the professor, and I come along to help him. So now I am caught. Yes, you bungled this job, too. But why did the Master Cylinder do this to you? Ask him. He's over there. Huh? The Master Cylinder? Yes, double-crossed by Clang to think that I'd be wearing these chains. On you, they look good. You two stop fighting. We've got to get out of here. Get out? <laughs> That's a laugh. I designed this dungeon myself. You did a good job. And it isn't funny. Well, I guess this is the end. You give up too easily, Felix. Who said that? I did. Hey! Who are you? A Martian in disguise. We're fighting General Klang, the same as you. Watch it. Boy, I'm free! Thanks, Mr. Martian. Don't mention it. Watch it, Professor. Sorry, Professor. Bah! And now to rescue Poindexter. But, but how? Allow me. General! In the flesh, so to speak. Now, I finish you. No? Okay, Felix. I can handle him from now on. Good luck. Thanks, Mr. Martian. Then we'll leave now. Leave? You can't leave me here. What'll I do? You can rest in peace. Come, Felix. We must find Poindexter. An explosion! That must be Poindexter. Mr. Felix, but let's hurry home. It's time for my nap. To the spaceship. Gee, but how are we going to get up there? Easy, Mr. Felix, with my little anti-gravity gun. Hey, give me...
job or something. That's it, a job. I'll just pack a little lunch and start looking. I need a lunchbox. Oh, my magic bag will do nicely. Professor, I dropped a bottle. What's the idea? I was just trying to clean up. This place is a mess. I know. We need a handyman around here. Here, put this in the window. Hmm. Handyman wanted. Huh? A sign. Handyman wanted. That's the professor's laboratory. Oh, well, a job is a job. Okay, Felix, you're hired. Let me take your bag. No, thanks. I have my lunch in it. Okay, get busy washing those bottles. <clears throat> yeah, and don't break any. <laughs> For years, I've been trying to get that bag, and now... I'll get it for you, Professor. Okay, but be careful. That bag is tricky. Yow! What, what was that? It was nothing. Uh, continue your work. Well, it's lunchtime. Uh, Professor, what good is that bag? Only Felix knows how it works. That's right. If I could only look inside. Hmm. I think I have an idea. What's that, Professor? Shh. This is liquid light. Liquid light? Yes. Felix's bag is open. You pour this inside. Then we can see how it works. Now I'll distract Felix. Oh, uh, uh, Felix, my boy, uh, uh, I was thinking. Huh? Oh, a glass of water for me? Thanks, Rock. Oh. Hey, I I'm fading away. Yeah, like an old soldier. Really, very simple and quite clear. You're transparent. Oh, no! I can't understand it, Professor. Why am I transparent? Because you drank my liquid light. That's why. Yeah, and now you're next to nothing. Well, don't just stand there looking through me. Do something. I will, if you'll do something for me. What? Show me the secret of your magic bag. Never! Okay, Bottlehead, suit yourself. through this door? No one. Professor, help! Everybody goes right through me. Professor, save me from that monster. Nonsense. It's just a clever illusion. I'll fix it. Hey, Professor, that clever illusion has sharp teeth. It's getting 
Pinker! Oh! Oh no! Phoenix! Help! Did you call? Phoenix, call off your monster! This isn't fair! Yeah? Well, what about me? Is this fair? <laughs> Solidify you. Okay, but work fast. What's that stuff? It's liquid dark. Drink it. Liquid dark? This better be good. That's more like it. There. You are now good as new. Solid, man. Solid. Now get rid of that monster. Okay. Incredible. Bye bye, monster. Oh, I feel faint. Professor, speak to me. Water. Here, drink this, Professor. But where am I? Yeah, no heads either. Rock, you fool! You gave me the liquid light! Well, this is where I came in. machine should be making instant money, but where is it? So, the professor's instant money is pouring into Felix's house. I'll have to reconnect these pipes. Oh, no, you're not. Is this your instant money, Professor? It's my money, all right. Rock, you blundered with the pipes. Disconnect them. Don't let Felix get any more of my instant money. Too late, boss. The mixture is all gone. I have the formula. I'll make another batch. What you looking for, Professor? The formula for instant money. It was here. This must be it, boss. Now, we've no money. Money? There's plenty over at Felix's. That's right. Let's go. This money belongs to somebody. Well, it'll just have to go back to where it came from. It's disappearing. Okay, boss. The old battering ram right through the door. Where's my money? Your money? Oh, no! That's right. He made it himself. Why, that's counterfeiting. And that's illegal. What did you do with it? I sent it back to where it came from. That means to the laboratory, boss. Hello? Hello? Police! Hurry! Hurry! Counterfeiters! Making money! Next door in the professor's laboratory! Hooray! Instant money! Hit the jackpot! We're set for life! Right! You're set for life! In the penitentiary! The police! You can't make money! Instant or regular! What's the use? Gee, 
there's nothing like relaxing with a good book like this. Now what? The wind is rattling the shutters. This latch is broken. I'll have to nail it shut. is much better. Flash, this is a report from the FBI. Be on the lookout for public enemies number one and two. The leader is a little guy with a big mustache and who is big and dangerous. Darn that TV set. I didn't get the names. Hmm, a big guy and a little guy with a big mustache. Rock Bottom and the Professor. Oh, well, I'm safe here. Gee, Professor, do you think Felix is home? Certainly. Knock again. Let's go inside. The professor and Rock Bottom. Uh oh, they're in the hall. He's not here. We'll wait for him. Gee, won't Felix be surprised to see us? Yes, he'll never get over it. I gotta escape. Those guys mean business. The window. Oh no, I nailed it shut from the outside. I'm trapped. If I only had my magic bag. But it's upstairs in the bedroom. Huh. The hot air pipe goes upstairs. Gee, it's dark in here. I see a light. The pilot light. I'm in the furnace. And the door's locked from the outside. Gosh, Professor, Felix is late getting home. Uh, just be patient. He'll be along. Yeah, but I'm getting chilly. The switch for the furnace is over there. Turn it on. Okay. Gee, it's getting warm in here. Oh. Turned on the heat. The heat! Gee, Professor, I'm getting tired of waiting for Felix. Me too. Here I am inside my furnace with the heat turned on. And the Professor and Rock are waiting for me outside. I'd better scram before I burn up. If I can get to my magic bed. There's the room now. And my magic bed. Hey, this grate is locked from the outside. I'm trapped. Oh, well, maybe Felix is in bed already. Let's go and see. Bring the stuff. Come on, Professor. Uh-oh. Look, Rock. The magic bag. And to think that I could never make it work for me. Yeah? Let me try it. No use, Rock. Only Felix knows the secret of the bag. Huh? You did it, Rock. The bag is working. I'm scared. I wish Felix was here. It's nice of you to drop in. Okay, you've got me. Now what? Relax, dear boy. We came as friends. Don't give me that. You guys are wanted by the FBI. <laughs> Flash, public enemies number one and two were captured by the FBI today. Okay, so you're clear. 
but I still don't get it. It's simple, friend. We just want to be friends. Sure, pal. Ooh, a roast turkey. But we ain't got no table to put it on. I can fix that. Ah, the magic bag. There you are. Likewise. My birthday? I forgot all about it. 